This is fun. Oh my god, look at that, bro. Diagonally. If you don't know what we're talking about, then go look at my TikTok. Just what you doing. Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Joanna Wilson. I'm joined today by my brother Niall Wilson and we're gonna be looking at some hilariously savage cheerleading fails today. Are you nervous? I'm petrified. I just try not to laugh or is this just a reaction? This is just a react. This is the first time we've both ever seen this and it's gonna be interesting to see whether they're So they're we're funny. not trying not to laugh, we can laugh. We can laugh. Are you ready? She missed the edge. Put that a few times. She was meant to flip off the edge of the tumble track. Her feet have gone off the edge. Is then she went to her neck? So I believe she was thinking about doing maybe a half, a, a, a whip half. <laughs> <laughs> As she turned midway through the air. Oh! oh shit, that was a clunk mush. Oh, broken ankle. Don't oh think you God. are all right, love. Don't think you are all right. She's convinced, though. I feel she? like that's what I would do if I did that. Yeah, I do. <laughs> First reaction is to be like, oh, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I'm just landing directly on my head, but it's fine. And then four minutes later, you realise that you actually need to call an ambulance. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here come the stunts. She's got a bad knee. Oh, it's not ending well, is it? What's he trying to do? Nice catch. What the hell, bro? You just let her drop to the floor? You didn't even attempt? First rule of being a base or a back spot. Catch your flyer. Never let your flyer hit the floor. You know what he did? Should we watch it again? You're like, see ya, see ya, what would I be ya? He just literally he just moved that out way. Let her hit floor, that's so bad. Oh, same thing. <laughs> These guys need to work on marking the run up. <laughs> Savage. <laughs> no, this looks like a basket set. No, no, these are my. I got that one that bad. That was. David, I could have hurt myself! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, David! I could have hurt myself! She did it herself? Oh, David. Oh, oh. That's such cheerleaders practicing the back touch. <laughs> Tell me she just tripped and she didn't snap a leg. Tell me she just tripped. Tell me she just tripped. She didn't snap a leg. It was just the most embarrassing <laughs> run up to a tumble I've ever seen. That's what non gymnasts like running up to a tumble. You're alright, but some like that's what they look like most of the time. Just absolutely like unconnected, disconnected from the freaking limbs. Oh gosh. Play that again, please. Like oh, no. Oh, no. Mm. To be honest, a lot of y'all are like. <laughs> that was funny. Oh. Should be walking out of a two and a half twist. Oh, God. Can I just say, you like, I, I massive respect for cheerleading is you just don't pay enough attention to the technique and thorough coaching of tumbling. It's hard as a gymnast to watch a lot of cheerleaders. You know what the thing is as well, for, for a long time in cheer, they just marked the skill on doing the skill rather than like how it's executed. So if you threw a back handspring, and back handspring is a very cheerleader term. Yeah, backflip. If you threw a backflip, no matter what it looked like, as long as your hands touched and then your feet touched and your head didn't you touch. You got a higher score. You got a higher score. Yeah, so it's like, I'll do backflip. So it's like, just get as many of the teams the amount of times you used to go to watch you at NRG and just see multiple girls like that. Like they in their heads, yeah. Oh, yeah. Send it. <laughs> She's just gone straight down. <laughs> Bless her. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Oh no. You've <laughs> <laughs> been shot. <laughs> no. 
Oh, what has she done? <laughs> As well, like if you're not experienced with doing it, you can be you can get good at bailing out a skill. Yeah, safely. I was gonna say. If I'm, you've got a good awareness, yeah. you know how to something's gone wrong. Yeah. You can understand where you are in the air as a gymnast and sort of safely manoeuvre your way out of it. Well, I'm back as well. Cheerleaders. It's so hard. It's so hard in the air. I'm gymnast for that matter. It's so hard in the air to split second this, but the worst, the safest thing you can do when you bail out of a tuck is to bring your arms in and land on your back. No matter where it is, whether it's like concrete or soft floor. So we, the, the idea of that is not... Yeah, not reaching down. your hands back because the, the force in which you're coming down, if your arms are reaching back and they're straight, you don't know where they're going to land. So what happens there, guys? Owen, roll the footage of when Eddie Hall punched Niall and he went flying. <laughs> Actually knocked out. When Eddie Hall hits Niall. Can I just say, when Eddie Hall hit me, I wasn't <laughs> conscious. I don't know what I did with the my body. The first thing you did was put his hand down. Well, that's what I mean. I, I've started that statement with, I know it's difficult. Yeah, okay. Because when you do bail Still out. Still roll the clip, though. Your, your fight or flight kicks in. It's just yeah. like, save yourself! Your brain goes, save yourself! There's a nose, a nice tumbler, a nice round flip. Oh, oh God, well, you can tell fan. what's going to happen here, oh, can't you? Fan, the fan. Oh! oh. They got to have done that on purpose. <laughs> oh God, it scares me when they're set for a basket. I'm, wor I'm worse watching tumbling. Hayley, you okay, Hayley? Four, five, six. Oh, oh. Hayley! Hayley, for God's sake, man. <laughs> see, see, same uh, thing, yeah, same thing. I mean, she got away with that, she was Hayley. Hold on, hard flow. Catch her. Oh, smackaroo. <laughs> You know what? It is really hard to tumble on sand though. Well, that's slow. <laughs> you gotta put some, some speed into it. Oh, it's God. It's soft. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one drive! Oh. oh, she's had bad days. Oh, it's a pyramid. Let's go, ladies. Oh, what an absolute oh. tool. Sick. Oh, should we do that? Absolutely not. I feel like you and Emily can maybe do that. Oh! She's hurt her neck. Smacked her jaw. Um, what's, why this? I don't know, it's just, um, you need to put your elbows together, please, when you do it. Can you put your elbows together? No, no. Ah. Yeah, why though? I don't know, it just sort of sets the, sets the... Move. Okay. In the tone. Just like looks cool. Yeah. Oh, it's a. Jeez. Oh, oh God. What are you doing? She's <laughs> 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 okay. not a good idea. Is it? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't like watching him. Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, jeez. That was a bloody good save. Was that at the end? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not ending well. <laughs> oh, God. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go team! Is this for flick or This what? is gonna not end well! What the f has she done? Was why she, why was, was that? Why flick over that? That's the worst flick prep I've ever seen but, in my life. But what is, she, is it, the idea is for her to jump backwards so her hands come here to the end of the block. Pause it at the top. Oh god. Just leave that there for you. 
Well, that was very tumble heavy. <laughs> Quite hilarious. To be honest though, all I honestly think, like watching a lot of cheerleading and like particularly tumbling, all I think a cheerleading team would need is literally one or two sessions with a gymnastics coach to focus on because I don't think the cheerleading coaches are well enough to sort of... Some. Like, I, we no, just well, watched like, a thought, series of... By the way, I feel like I'm slagging off cheerleading here. I'm absolutely not. I think it's brilliant. Like, it's awesome. I've actually been a cheerleader for a couple of competitions, which, believe it or not, I have. Maybe we'll talk about that in a later video. In terms of tumbling, if they just invested a little bit more time with a specific gymnastics coach, it, like, it only needs if you can do a round off flip like you can like you probably got one of the best but like because you're around gymnastics yeah all it needs is like one or two sessions for you to just say yeah. like why are your legs apart and bent you've got enough power to do a flick yeah. the legs don't need to be apart and bent they don't thanks for watching everyone i hope you enjoyed this let us know if there's any other things that you'd like us to react to in the comments to all my cheerleaders out there i love you keep smashing it and remember anything's possible if you train smart keep it real if you just want